we present Animating the Uncaptured, which animates human meshes from a text prompt. We address the task of text emotion for humanoid meshes. Given a text description of emotion and an input mesh, we animate the mesh according to the described motion. Our key idea is to leverage the prior from video diffusion models, which can produce a diverse set of realistic motions. We generate a video and then optimize for the transfer of the motion video to the mesh. From an input mesh, we generate its corresponding video, then register simple to the mesh for tracking, and finally optimize for motion transfer to the mesh. We first render the input mesh and use the rendered image along with a text prompt to condition a video diffusion model and generate a video of the mesh performing the described motion. From the generated video, we extract its silhouette, identify body landmarks, and compute dense per pixel features with a pre-trained Dino V2 encoder. We analogously annotate the input mesh with dense features, rendering it from multiple views, extracting the features with the same encoder, and projecting them back onto the mesh. In addition to these dense features, we incorporate a body prior and sparse key points using a simple body model as a deformation proxy. We optimize the pose, shape, translation, scale, and rotation of the simple model to align to the input mesh such that its joints best match detected 2D joint landmarks from multiple views. After alignment, we reparameterize the coordinates of the input mesh vertices by computing their barycentric coordinates with respect to the closest face on the simple mesh. This enables animation of the mesh using simple parameters. Finally, to transfer the motion from a synthesized video to the mesh, we optimize for the per-frame pose, translation, and rotation. We use a neural representation for these parameters to take advantage of the inductive bias of MLPs, which produces smoother motions. These MLPs take as input the frame index and positional encoding and output the corresponding simple parameters. To optimize this, we use the extracted body landmarks, silhouette, mask, and dense features, and also enforce temporal smoothness for more realistic results. We compare our method against MDM on the task of text-conditioned motion generation. Our method is able to generate a broader range of motions. Here we show more qualitative results. Thanks for watching.